What's up, Tom Kippers? Me, Tom Kipper here, bringing another part of Red Dead Redemption. So, if ready, I'm ready. Time to roll the intro. <laughs> hey, Gringo. Mr. Ricketts, come on in. Sit down and have yourself a drink. Sure. Say, any word of Javier Escuela? Uh, no, nothing yet. Say, why are you after him anyway? We're old friends. <laughs> we was kind of educated together. <laughs> so what is this, some kind of high school reunion sort of thing? Pretty much. Something like that. Well, well you've killed people. You lived the life. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <sighs> that I have. And I tried to stop. I mean, I don't know. I tried to go straight. I did. I left the gang after the gang left me. Left me to die after I'd been shot. I mean, God damn. They'd all gone crazy anyhow. Our old leader, a fella you probably heard of. Anyway, he more or less lost his mind, went and shot a bunch of people unfair like. I got shot in a robbery. They left me, and I left them. <laughs> exactly how it works. Well, that's how it goes. I'll drink today. Already had me a woman. Got me a farm. Then I got me more trouble. Sure. <laughs> I've been sent to track down the men I used to run with. Track them. Kill them. Well, if you don't, someone else will. <laughs> There's no escape. Look at me. I spent 25 years killing men. Look at me now. Sitting around here like some low rent would be messiah. <laughs> We're relics. Come on, have yourself another drink and let's wallow in a little self pity. Sounds like a plan. Your health. Mr. Ricketts. God. Mr. Ricketts, thank you. I was just drinking. You. And you, Mr. Marston. Will you sit down? You all right? I'm well, sir. But Allende is sending more men to the death. Prisoners who have not been tried. A prominent writer, Castilla, and a local official whose only crime was not putting the small holders on the street when they were late with taxes. Writers and government officials. For once, I agree with Allende. Some men need to be killed. Mr. Ricketts! I was just joking. Where are they? <laughs> Out. <laughs> they're, they're, escalera. they're still gonna die, but... Let's hang up ourselves. Just, just, just joking. ourselves some bad guys. <laughs> you're gonna be all right. Oh, boy. Thank you. Both of you. She recovers fast, though, from the last time we saw her. Let's head for Escalera. Mount a horse. Where the fuck's my horse? Excuse me, you are not my horse. No rush. I'm sure they'll hold the executions till we get there. There's my horse. Luisa was pretty shaken up. Oh shit. <laughs> this war is getting dirtier by the day. People are being executed for just having an opinion. Linda seems to have more enemies by the day. Perhaps you would know. Rumor has it you've been making all kinds of new friends. I don't pay much attention to rumors. Just be careful, John. Keep jumping from one side of the fence to the other. You might just get impaled on it. I have to find these two men. With respect. How I do it is no concern of yours. Come on. your tone wisely, partner. Remember who you're talking to. How could I ever forget? And who are you, John Marston? Apart from a rat feeding every other hand he can find, my name means something. All you've done is kill a few peasants. And the only reason outlaw you've taken on dropped you like a bad habit. Now, I reveal I'm personal to information to you. Tone, and then you take me down like that. There's a reason why people around here don't want to talk. Get up! You must miss your family. It's the only thing that keeps me going. You know, you remind me a lot of myself. How I used to be. Stubborn and angry. You ain't yeah. changed all that much. I always thought... You see that? Prison wagons. That must be them. This is our chance. What are you doing? See if you can take control of that first wagon. For the love of God! Yeah. 
Jeez, Ricketts, thanks for help. Thanks for waiting. Oh, come on, come on. I don't want to lasso him. What the fuck are you doing? You're almost there. Come on. Get on the prison wagon. Gonna paint my wagon. We need to get these prisoners to America. They'll be safe there. Head for the bridge. Go on. What the fuck you think I'm doing? Whip it. Whip it good. Let's go, go! Oh my god! Those Mexicans. John Marston started illegal immigration, I guess. Riding with you, Mr. Ricketts. <laughs> Mr. Ricketts. And you too. You took me back to another time. Talk to Louisa. She'll help you, and she's well connected in that other land. I hope you find what you're looking for, Marston. You know what I'm looking for. <laughs> oh, you do know what I'm looking for. If you say so, Marston. If you say so. What do you want, Gringo? Oh, can't, can't wait. What are you doing here? Tired of being called a gringo now. <laughs> Have you heard? There's a war going on. My name's John Marston. Been sent here to retrieve a couple of men. Can I speak to your commander? Yeah. Oh, it's definitely a good purchase. You probably can get it easily you for like ten dollars. To my boss, gringo. I guess. Yes, I may go. Because I'm not good enough for you. No, sir. You think you're better than me? I said nothing. Nothing of that you kind. To my country. My poor little country, and you think you can be friends with the president? Oh, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Things must have come out wrong. Maybe you can help me. Be sorry, friend. Jesus Christ, guys, calm down. <laughs> relax. I mean, relax. <laughs> uh, funny. Gee, huh? Sure. Somewhere between a threatening stare and the soldiers armed to the teeth. Yeah. Yeah, a bit. <laughs> As, when when he was talking, I was thinking about Al Pacino. <laughs> I was thinking about Scarface. <laughs> and then we'll talk. My name is Capitan Vicente de Santa. John Marston. My country 
It is in pain, John Master. Terrible pain. The rebels have seized the people by the throat and destroyed a way of life. I'm no politician, sir. <laughs> and I am uh, no soldier, Aquila. Mm -hmm. But we are both beholden to our time. To our Perhaps time. Perhaps you've heard of him. Coronel Alande. He's trying to preserve the order in our province. To keep our civilization alive. It is tough. The people are confused and usually swayed. Sometimes in the service of what is right. Set the Brent tequila and he brings the Patron out. Good quality. It breaks my heart. I also am no moralist, sir. I wish I enjoy your freedoms. Mr. Marston. I'm trying to find Mr. A Marston. An American. An outlaw named Bill Williamson. Aren't we all? I believe he came here to seek protection from another outlaw named Javier Escuela. You're no moralist, but you hunt outlaws? So it would seem. So it would seem. I am the governor. Or what is left of it. Outlaws seek each other. They're possibly hiding with thieves and killers who pose as freedom fighters in the hills around here. They're united under one traitor named Abraham Reyes. Where could I find this Reyes? If I knew, I would be there. <laughs> Makes sense. I'm in him with everything that is true within me. Reyes finds you. Like cholera. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. But it's possible, though. My men are trying to lure him into a trap. Possibly you could ride with us. And if everything goes okay, I'm okay. sure the Coronel will help you. All right. Okay. Mmm. Tequila. Are you going to ride with me? Taking the carriage. <clears throat> I guess I can ride shotgun. Ride shotgun. Do 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 do. It's not far now. Are you ready? Ready for what? Well, I'm riding we'll shotgun. Let's take the shotgun out. There's a train leaving to Parosa soon. We're going to escort it. They will think it's a supply train. But there are no supplies on it. Very clever. We must throw the rats out of their holes. Give them some bait they can refuse. The train is waiting. Why, we take a, why didn't we not just take horses? Oh, because we brought the supplies. Okay, I get it now. Follow me. Hurry! Andale, andale, andale. Vamos, rapidos. Should go farther. I'll take lead. Don't worry, guys. I got the lead. Any day now, guys. Wow. Trains back there were very, very slow. There they go. Come on, turn around, turn around. Sorry, horse. El Muerto. There you go, Tito.
You should be on the train. Oh shit, that's not good. Oh, did I get a headshot on that one? Oh. Oh shit. That is not good whatsoever. Alright, fuck you then. I have to go back in front. God damn it, I'm on the other side. Jesus Christ, this is not helping. What are you doing? Underlay, singer, underlay. Oh, now not the horse. I, have you guys thought about thought about killing them? See, it's this easy, guys. Just have point and shoot, point and shoot. That's all you do. Holy shit, that took a lot of damage. Oh no. I'm doing a horrible and... Fuck. Damn it. Oh shit, okay. Oh my god, what the fuck? Wolf, not the time. Not the time, not the time. I'm slowly but surely running out of ammunition. Let's go. Let's go. Jesus Christ, that went from very noisy to no noise whatsoever. Good, good. Oh, of course. What the fuck is that? Marston, you're gonna have to do something. What? You have to go out there and start the train before it crosses the bridge. Todavía levántese. Usted también. Y allá para muévase. ¿Qué le pasa a usted? Ay, Dios mío, levántese. Come on, guys, get the fuck.
Uh oh. No bueno. I wasn't even close to the bridge. I guess we're not crossing anytime soon. One hell of a drop. Uh, my family is indebted to you. Forgive my English. What's happening? Great and terrible things. The revolution is coming. The country will be in turmoil once more. This time, we hope it's the last time. Does that seem likely? With Abraham Reyes, anything is possible. Where's your family going? My parents and my brother are headed to the hills. My sister has to flee. The army have an unfortunate way of treating women. And you? Don't worry about me, Mr. Marston. I'm living in history. I'm not afraid to die. Your nobility is almost as affecting as your naivete. I would rather be dead than a cynic like you, Mr. Marston. I would too. I know you're not really like that. You saved me. Uh, Luisa, ¿quién va a salvar a Miranda? Tenemos que llevar al puerto su barco sale al anochecer. No queda tiempo. Mr. Marston, can I ask one more favor of you? Can you take my sister to the docks? We are sending her to work for a kind man in the Yucatan. She's too young for revolution. Okay. Anything I can do to help out? The boat leaves at sundown. Miranda, vamos. Oh, adios, Miranda. Ten cuidado. Adios. Te amo. Emilio works as a driver. We will take his stagecoach. God damn it. Stupid fed fed it out of this. Papeles. Este camino está prohibido. What do they want now? Act normal. It's nothing to worry about. Te conozco. Eres un pinche rebelde. Disparen! No la dejen escapar! Hurry! Hurry! God damn it. I saw all of it. My wagon. The army is everywhere looking for rebels. We need to avoid any checkpoints we see. God damn it. Let's go, horse. You can do it. Oh dear God, no! What the? Fuck? Yeah, that's not good whatsoever. Oh my God, are you kidding me?
We lost him. Are we gonna make it? Holy moly, come on. Not some man on a carriage is going to stop me now. You get going. Travel safely. Au revoir. Well, thank you so much, guys, for watching. Of course, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. We really appreciate it. Leave a comment below. Uh, what if whatever you liked in the video, whatever missions you liked uh, in Mexico themselves. Of course, follow follow me everywhere. Me, Tom Gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, Instagram, and right here, YouTube.com for slash Me, Tom Gamer, where I post a new video every week, Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Time. Thanks so much, guys, for watching. I will see you next video. Keep on keeping on.